Hey guys, it's Kazla. We're back with some more uh, Tales of Vesperia. Uh, I moved this past weekend, so if audio seems a little bit weird, uh, it's still working out the new place, so that's why. Um, but we're going to go and jump back in here. We're not too far from the end of the game. Uh, I think counting tonight's stream, we've got two streams left. Um, <clears throat> as we are pushing uh, to that, uh, we are working on uh, awakening these new spirits. We've awakened three of the uh, four that I think we have to. <clears throat> so we just have one left. Um, but I worked our way out of the last dungeon uh, so that we didn't just have all that backtracking on screen. Uh, but we're going to watch this skit and see what happens. <laughs> We are going to, uh, I apparently somehow chose Japanese audio. I was having some issues with my switch before I got on. Um, apparently there's a certain way you have to insert the cords in a certain order or else your switch dock doesn't work. <clears throat> Which was wonderful to learn when you have a dead switch. And I can hear the wife yelling at the dogs. So that is some audio that I'm going to have to figure out how to deal with. I think what I'm going to end up doing is I'll put some sound catching foam on some of these walls. And hopefully, uh, hopefully that'll solve the issue. It's so loud right now. Okay. Gonna go ahead and start this. Oh, old Goosey turned into Gnome safe and sound. That's a load off. Yes, it would have been tragic if he'd transformed into an Autophagos. Yeah, he's just fulfilling the role he was meant to play. I doubt he ever thought that his transformation might have caused the cataclysm itself. I feel for the poor Entelikea who became Autophagos in the past. If only they'd had the option of spirit conversion. Young lady, don't dwell too much on all the what ifs. Maybe they didn't have a choice, but those who became Autophagos are trying to devour this world. That is the reality. I know, but it's just so sad. Okay. It's trying to. Come on, let's do this! Call my flyer. <laughs> We gotta go to now, I believe, is down on button. Down here on the southern continent somewhere, the south eastern continent. Also seemingly never stopped at this continent. But it looks like it's just <clears throat> Four materials, so no big deal. Um, be, I think it's somewhere on here. All those bones should be. Materials. Is it right here? That's the only thing that looks like it could be something. So Area Lumen is something Gusios created. Right. I remember seeing a similar crystal back at Ker Bakram. Yeah, you were pretty absorbed in that thing. The Rita radar never lets any objects of interest go undetected. 
Oh, I forgot. If Gusios undergoes spirit conversion, I won't be able to investigate him. There goes the reader radar. Don't get carried away now. Okay, let's try here. It's the only thing that sticks out. And we'll save just in case. Yep. So this is Reloise? Yes, Baul yes, says, it is. says it is. But, but I don't see I don't any Aircrene or, or Entelikea. Looks like we can Looks take like this, can path, take this down. path down. It's a long, it's way, a long down. way down. Yes, it, yes is. it is. Now that is a sight to behold. Please be careful not to fall, Patty. Carol's the one you ought to be worrying about taking a tumble here. Th that's not true! Let's get going. Yes, it looks like that's all we can do. Hey, why don't we just ride Baul all the way to the bottom? No, it's narrow, and the wind is all over the place. It's a little too dangerous. This wind is fierce indeed. This place must be where all the gales are born. That means this valley is the mother of the wind. The mother of the wind, huh? I can see a river way down at the bottom! This is what happens when a river wears away at the earth for years and years. Ah, the power of nature. Who knows how long it took to make this. Whoa! I get all dizzy when I look straight down. Idiot. <laughs> well, just make sure you don't slip and fall. Okay. So I guess we have to work our way down. I wonder if there are going to be monsters we have to fight on the way. Yep. Watch my back. What's the secret of your strength? I don't know. Maybe I just have fun fighting. You are certainly a fighter. I can do even better than... That big of a deal. He's too far down that we can't target this him. This one's strong. Don't just stand there whining. There's no way we're gonna lose. That's the way we're supposed to go. So let me cut back. 
and go right. So we don't miss any chests or anything. Let's eliminate them. A little bit too late. Oh, that was Shall I heal you? The sign of victory. Ooh, Ooh I can't wait to fight this one. Get ready for anything. This guy off of a spell. Divide comes a new spell. Don't get in our way. Good, okay. Uh, looks like there's rocks blocking our this way this enemy way doesn't is. look so nice. Ooh, scary, scary. <laughs> That was a nice little break. Finish that. Okay, so I can't get through that. So we'll go up and around. Oh, I can't wait to fight this one. We must be cautious. <laughs> Wonderful! Dragon Sword! Arise, a light of light! Dragon Sword! Let them die under the holy That wasn't too bad. Came in like a wrecking ball there. Fatal Strike was pretty sweet. How do we get 
through those. This enemy doesn't look so nice. Ooh, scary, scary. Dragon Sword! Oh, Dragon Sword! That was so easy. Try and freeze it to get around. I don't care what rock you crawled out from. Bring it. I think we want to go the other way. Tracking to try and get looped. Nice little helm for her. I have been trained by knights. I won't lose. Strength is 
Okay, now we're good to go on. Hey, buddy, how are you doing? Oh, I can't wait to fight this one. Don't just stand there whining. The secret of my strength. Doing all right. Uh, just a little tired we moved this past weekend so uh, a little wore down from that uh, but otherwise good they're wide open it doesn't seem fair yeah, that's a. We had my wife working with the movers, and then I was here working with a cable company. So we get everything set up as quickly as possible. Without too much interruption. Oh God, it's a lot of stuff to do in a weekend. That was a nice little break. Just here still. Okay, it's just a bow. Okay, go by this B. how big this dungeon is going to be. Hopefully it's not too bad. Hmm. Can sneak by him, but at least they're stunned to start. Get ready for anything. Still, he just joins me to do. Here, and you probably don't need to. That wasn't too bad. on this kind of stuff gets to us old folks come on old man yeah you're gonna have to climb back up when we're done he's dead <laughs> Appearing out of nowhere as usual. Many thanks for rescuing Yuri. Why are you the one thanking him? What are you doing here? We heard there was an Antilochia here. We came to ask it to become a spirit. A spirit? A being that comes from reincarnating an Antilochia through an Apatheia. 
we might be able to solve the air problem completely with the spirit's power. By converting air into mana. I see. That's why. Duke? Reincarnation. Converting air. You are trying to remake the world itself. All to solve a problem that humans themselves brought about. Such arrogance. But if we don't fix the air problem, the Atafagos will destroy the world. Bellius understood. She became Undine and is lending us her power. Pharaoh as well. He was reborn as a freak. The proper form of Terka Lumeres is one in which all living things, including Entelikea, live in their natural state. You understand that as well. But what about Gusios? He was trying to control the air. But then he took too much and became really dangerous. Yeah. I don't want to think what would have happened if we hadn't reincarnated him as Gnome. Indeed. Humans in Entelikea can find a way to coexist by pushing these boundaries. Even so, I do not accept it. I will protect this world. You said that before. So just how do you plan to protect the world? I will not interfere with you, so do not interfere with me. Ahead lies one of the oldest springs in the world. Pay it due respect. So you won't answer the main question? Hmm. Farewell. I doubt we shall meet again. Uh, hey! He's gone! Such a warm and fun-loving little fellow. I wonder what he's trying to do. I don't know, but I have a bad feeling about it. Let me go ask him. Not a soul alive would refuse to answer a beautiful laugh. Patty, darling, you just don't have the good graces for an approach like that to work. Rita, is something wrong? Well, I bet with his sword, with Dane Nomos, we could focus the spirit's energy on the Autophagos. Should we chase him down and ask him to lend it to us? Yeah, I don't think he's in much of a giving mood right now. Me neither. Well, whatever we do, we have to get all the spirits first. Let's focus on that for now. Yeah, Duke's voice is oddly deep. I also, his design is very reminiscent of Yuri. And so I don't know if that plays into anything as well. I just remember, did I go this way? I'm doubting myself on whether or not I went this way. I did not. They got us from behind. Our ties to each other will save us. Dragon Swarm! Dragon! Dragon Swarm! Dragon! 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 Dragon!
You picked the wrong people to stronger. Okay. Where? This path, this side path is so long. Additional 25% TP is huge. We'll destroy them in no time. Five K off that one spell. So is that okay? Okay, now for the long walk back. Led to nothing. Mainly because I don't have anything that can break those blocks yet. Fight this one. We must be cautious. Dragon Swarm! Let them die under power. Dragon Swarm! 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 So is that okay? I have Let's eliminate them. Silly mimic. These mimics in this game aren't as bad as some other things.
fire resist. Let's eliminate them. Throwing everything together. Alright, who's next? You picked the wrong people to fight, guess practice. Using Estelle for her physical attacks. So, that rod's a good we'll upgrade. We'll destroy them in no time! That was so easy. I can do finish that. Give a good amount of level ups though here. Have to keep it in mind for if I need to come back in power now. the other way since that's the way to our target which I assume is going to be a boss fight trying to get by him watch my back to do This one's pretty tough. Don't just stand there whining. Way. 
got an upgrade. Ooh, I can't wait to fight this one. We must be cautious. Any counters have Jimmy's I don't know. <laughs> These enemies are pretty easy and good. So can we just speed. go all out? So like, part of me doesn't want to complain about fighting them. Let That wasn't too bad. We're fully healed, too. And some Octopath Traveler vibes here. Wow! So, this is the oldest spring in the world. It's so quiet. The air is so clear. It feels holy. Never would have thought a place like this was at the bottom of the mountain. I feel so... at ease. This isn't really a good time to kick back and relax, but... it is so peaceful. Watch it! That's air, not water. It's really dense. You shouldn't go near it. You came. Hey, that's... We met you at the castle, didn't we? Chroma, was it? It doesn't look like you're trying to avenge Alexei. Duke didn't listen to you, did he? He's trying to protect the world in his own way. So what is Duke trying to do? He's trying to exchange the lives of humans to protect the world. What? Why would Duke do something like that? He doesn't trust humans. But Duke helped us! He even lent us his beloved blade! I assume he saw some of himself in you. Or perhaps he thought he wouldn't have to get his hands dirty as long as you were around. W what are you...? Why are you telling us about Duke? I think it's time you showed who you really are, Antilochea. Huh? That form! What do you want? Is this just a roundabout way of saying you're not going to help? I too cannot trust humans. But neither do I want to see him take revenge on his own kind. If you can truly save the world, then I will not refuse to help. However, 
You have chosen a different path. You will likely confront each other. Yeah, maybe. If he is beyond your power, then nothing in this world can stop him. I will test your strength! Here she comes! That's what we get for taking on an Antilochia. Come on, guys. Stay sharp. I'm not finished with you yet. We'll keep playing with you till you die. This is my wager. Will you win or will I? Nothing more than that. Come. We might look weak, but fate is on our side. This one's tough. over everything leave the rest to us <laughs> yeah yeah it tends to like the game will yell at you if you like your TP starting to get low they'll say that you're using too many I can do even better than this. Uh, I'm even faster. if you spam a lot of items they'll do the same thing marvelous perhaps you all can indeed save the world Chroma, do as you wish. Is 
Estelle, come on. Judith? Right. Do it. It worked! She's sleeping. It's the same as with Gnome. A new comrade has been born. One who controls the winds. At times calm, at times violent. She is not taken by air as was known. She should wake before long. Thank you, Undine. Chroma did say she wanted us to stop Duke. It seemed like Chroma knew a lot about Duke. Indeed. Maybe we can ask her more when she's awake. Let's head back for now. Right. We don't have time to just hang around here. Oh, not that path again. These old bones of mine are tired. God, we have to walk all the way out? Yes, I wonder... Is there an item that lets me get out? Nope. Well, that's gonna suck. This sure is a lonely place. It's just rocks and mountains, and the wind just sounds so lonely. It feels more desolate the longer we're here. Let's finish up here and get out soon. But the sun is so warm and feels so nice. Well, aren't you optimistic? Oh? But this is the perfect time for a picnic. Maybe we are lucky to have sunshine. I mean, it looks like there could be a sandstorm any moment. I guess we were letting the atmosphere get to us. Come on, it's not so bad. Yes, let's keep going. They sure cheered up quick. Hopefully not everything respawns. 